I didn't like Souls games. Yeah, I said it. I can admit it. I'm a p Hey guys, and how do to all of you? My name is Hammerage. Let me talk to you about something. It's a game franchise that started all the way back in 2009, first released on the PlayStation 3, spawned many games, clones, and loads of anger and frustration. And me? Well, I wasn't aware of them. Not during that time, at least. No, it was actually until a friend of mine joined me for my birthday one year. We went to a second of Charles and was browsing the games, trying to find something to play and take home and all that, and all of a sudden my friend picks up a game and puts it in my hand. Hey, it's a gift, and I like video games. You could have given me Barney the Dinosaur in Genesis, and I could have still made form for it. Even though I find happiness, I'll never be happy. The gift was a copy of... Dark Souls 2, Scholar of the First Sin. You don't want to be like me. No! Yes, I know, it's despised. Luckily though, I was quick to put it in and take it out just as quick because I got pissed off. Every time I tried to attack, I kept dying. Every time I tried to explore, I kept dying. Every freaking time I would just turn the freaking camera angle or just die by a freaking monster I couldn't kill. Yes, you're right. I had no idea what I was doing. It was something I tried to invest my time in. Did it work? I mean, it looked like fun and the environment looked engaging to say the least, but damn it, I couldn't kill a freaking monster. I went in there with a freaking careless hack and slash, I'll obliterate anything in my path mindset and got my booty owned for it. I kept saying, nope. No, 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 no. I turned it off, quit the game and moved on to something else. And then, we had a little into the future. <laughs> it's the holidays. Black Friday sales are going on and I want some new games to play. So I start looking. Found some interesting titles here and there that I put in the cart. And I saw one that had me a bit intrigued because I see the company name, remember a fun game from said company, and thought, hey, this looks like it will be fun. Well, I was right later on about it. The game was Neo, and this was a Souls clone basically. Had it shipped to my house, saw the game, put it in the PS4, waited on the update. Bada boom, bada bang, I was in the game. And as we began playing it, well, not this again. Yeah, I just realized I picked up Dark Samurai or Samurai Souls? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. And once again, it was going to be a game where I was going to put down and say, Nope, not doing this again. But I had other games updating and I couldn't play anything else. So I gave it a chance. Once I did, hey, this game isn't half bad. I mean, sure, it's, it's difficult and it could be aggravating sometimes, somewhat, and the bosses are... All right, come on, come on, no! <laughs> I gave it a chance and actually enjoyed it. Why? Well, I took my time, I got used to it more properly, and figured out how everything worked. And then I started actually having fun. Because of that, I decided to give Dark Souls 2 another chance. When I did... <sighs> Going forward with the fucking bolt. No! I moved on to Bloodborne, Elden Ring, and more clones like The Surge. I liked the style, I enjoyed the gameplay, and came to a realization why everybody enjoyed these games. Now I get it, there's some people out there that still don't like the games or the style, and that's totally understandable. I get it. But I eventually came around to it, and now I really enjoy the games. It's been an on and off experience playing Bloodborne, and I'm having a ton of fun with it, even if there's no blocking in it. And we'll definitely try out some other Souls-like games later on. Now, if you're judging it because you've seen it or you hear it's too hard, don't really let that stop you. It just takes practice. Just like with anything else people do. You know, driving a car, cooking a meal, fixing a wire, or playing an instrument. It takes time and patience. And the better you get, the more fun it's going to become. It is difficult, but it's not impossible either. That's why I enjoy them now and have nothing against them. The thing is, is I have a huge backlog of games I gotta work on that I want to prioritize first. I'll get to them eventually, I just don't feel like screaming at the screen like I usually do when I play them. <laughs>